Jesus was leaving the temple with his disciples when one of them admired the huge stones and impressive buildings. Jesus said that the temple would be destroyed, with not a single stone left on another. Later, Jesus was sitting on the Mount of Olives with some of his closest disciples, who asked him when these events would happen and what signs to look for. Jesus warned them to be careful not to be deceived by people claiming to be the Messiah. He said that there would be wars, earthquakes, and famines, which are just the beginning of difficult times. Jesus also mentioned that his followers would face persecution, be arrested, and stand trial. They should not worry about what to say during trials, as the Holy Spirit would guide them. He warned that families would betray each other and that many people would hate them because of their faith. He told them to watch for a specific sign, the abomination that causes desolation, and to flee to safety when they saw it. It would be especially hard for pregnant women and nursing mothers during these times, and Jesus advised them to pray it doesn't happen in winter. Jesus also mentioned that after these distressing times, there would be dramatic cosmic signs, like the sun and moon losing their light. Then, he would return with great power, and angels would gather his followers from all over. He used the example of a fig tree to explain that just as its new leaf signal summer is near, these signs will show that the end is approaching. Jesus assured that his words would last forever, even though heaven and earth will eventually pass away. Finally, Jesus said that no one knows the exact day or hour of these events, only God knows. He compared it to a man who leaves his house and tells his servants to stay alert for his return at any time. Jesus told his followers to stay awake and be ready, as he will come back unexpectedly.